nowadays i hear more and more fund managers talking about diversification all the people who used to say that only a concentrated portfolio can make you outsize returns or uh, at least uh, give you outperformance are now saying that diversification is better uh, so is it that if you hold instead of 14 stocks you hold 40 stocks in a portfolio that will automatically give you outperformance or alpha uh, so, so so what is the truth and often people talking about it do not understand the logic so it is not as if that if you hold more stocks your performance will be better so what is the logic for diversification why is it that we speak of diversification and why is it that since we started over three and a half years ago we've been the best performing uh, multi-cap uh, PMS and also uh, especially on a risk adjusted basis so what diversification does is this it makes sure that your actual returns are closer to the expected value of the returns or expected value depending on your skill so I mean let me explain now, this might sound complicated but it's actually quite simple uh, so if you toss a coin 10 times you know a coin is expected to, um, to have a 50% probability of uh, heads or tails but if you toss it only 10 times it may happen that you might get only 2 heads or even 8 or 9 heads basically the predictability is not very high in a small number of tosses but if you toss it 100 times it is going to be closer to that 50-50 number so what diversification does is that in investing which is the game of skill and luck it increases the component of the skill so if you are skillful enough for example to pick the right stocks 65 percent of the time because no fund manager or investor in the world is ever right 80 90 100 percent of the time so forget about that so even if you get to 60 percent actually it is pretty good so what diversification does is that if you are buying you know 50 stocks instead of 15 stocks you are more likely to be close to that 60 or 65 percent hit rate so that is what it does so if you ha actually have a skill it will ensure that shows up in your results but if you don't have the skill you know, just increasing the number of stocks is not going to help because fewer stocks what it does is it increases the element of luck so if you're buying only 12 or 15 stocks there's a great element of luck in the performance at times it might even favor you so there might be you know one or two years when uh, that kind of strategy does very well but diversification increases predictability and makes it predictable that your results will be closer to your skill level so diversification works only if you have the skill only if your system actually is designed that way that it will give you outperformance then it will ensure that in the real world also you have outperformance so this is about diversification versus concentration uh, i hope it helped and uh, if you have questions uh, let us know in the comments